welcome Mikey to the stage. Big him up! <laughs> Can I just say, uh, this is crazy. Like, you guys have been so supportive. I never knew there was such a thing like this in Leeds, so big up you guys. Like, this is nuts. <clears throat> I materialize straight into your past. Realize that I'm looking ahead and forgetting about the last time I had to let go. I'm mad, yes, I know, but I feel like a new man. The same pounding of drums on the inside. Ba -bum, ba -bum, ba -bum. Beating to a whole new rhythm, rhythm, rhythm. <laughs> and whilst the past may remind me of bananas and feeling flustered, the future tastes a lot like fish fingers and custard. Surprisingly good, but a little oud. Sorry, I meant odd. There's memories to be exterminated, people to be upgraded, and things to be sonicked. So join me on a journey through time and space. See these old eyes and remember this face, because everything's going to be fine. It's like I'm 11 when I used to be nine. I was fighting for acceptance with a steep incline, and I found an English rose I'd wanted to be mine. When I was 10, I could have given you my hand. Then you took yourself away as you suddenly planned. And I'll bring you back because you know I could. Because we shine brighter than when you torch wood. There we go. You got it. <laughs> now the clock strikes 11. And we're ready to go. Uh, starting our journey with a Geronimo. Because there's so many things that I have to show. But we need time to breathe and to take it slow. There is so much beauty in this world. You're like a gigantic whale floating through space. I mean, I'm a gigantic whale floating through space. And you'll be England erected proudly in place. I mean, I'll be erected in place. I... Okay, so that is from uh, season five, episode two, The Beast Below, written by Stephen Moffat. Uh, spoiler alert, they're all actually on this giant space whale that's floating through space, basically. Sorry about that. We can see the birth of every star. We can see the beginning of the end or the end of the beginning and we can begin again. We can be the now or then. We can see the how and when. We can weave through constellations and sail through creations of nebulas and galaxies, alternate realities and still be back in time for tea. The TARDIS will always take us to where we need to go, not where we want to go. And that can be hard, I know. There's fixed moments in time that can't be rewritten if you haven't gotten to series five yet. And so it's in these moments that things are permanently set. And I'm sorry. It's time to regenerate. And in my life, new life, I will remunerate. But first, I will boldly glow a bodily gold and blow up inside with the same secrets to hide. I'll still be a man-man with a box. I'll still be the oncoming storm. And I will still tell people that I'm the doctor. And they will say, doctor, <laughs> you may have a broken heart, but pity the man with two. Thank you. Thank you.